Hi, this is Chris Cool with Geeks on Tour, and I want to show you the quick and easy way to use Google Photos to keep your travel albums so that you are all done by the time you get home. Don't be like people who take a one-week trip and say they took so many pictures it's going to take them two weeks once they get home to organize it. No, let me show you how. So first of all, we're using Google Photos. You recognize that icon, I hope. For purposes of this video, I'm going to take you back to December 2015 when my husband and I took a trip to Cuba. A very special trip. And I can just scroll right back there. So the first day of our trip was December 4, 2015. And here we are taking a selfie at the airport. Right away, what I'm going to do is start an album. What you, you just swipe up on the photo and tap on Add to Album and New Album. Give it a name and tap the check mark. I now have an album started. And as I take more pictures, so remember I'm pretending that we're just going on this trip right now. Got it? <laughs> and I'm taking pictures all day and I say, oh, I so like these pictures of the old cars. So I tap one. I say, gee, that looks pretty good. I want to add that to the album. Swipe up, add to album, and it will be in your recent 2015 Cuba trip. Now notice I have a lot of pictures of the old cars. Some people would say delete all the ones that you don't want to keep and then what you're left with is the good ones. But I say, I can't delete any of these. These are all great. But for purposes of my album, I'm just going to choose one or two. Now here's one of my very, I really, really like this one, a red car. Swipe up, add to album, Cuba trip. Now realize you can be doing this as you're on the trip. You take a picture, you say, that's a great one. You add it to the album done. Now I'm not saying you should never delete. I mean this picture is obviously a mistake. I can just tap the trash can and it will be removed from my Google account and from the device that took the picture. But since Google gives me free unlimited storage, no reason to delete if I don't need to. You can also add videos to your album. I love this one. Swipe up, add to album, 2015 Cuba trip and then go back to your library. If you see several you want, you can s select them. Touch and hold, select another one, select another one, tap the plus and add to 2015 Cuba trip. Now at this point in the trip we took a bus to from Havana to the Bay of Pigs and I want that picture and that picture and then we have to have some picture of food right plus and Cuba trip but I want some description in my album so let's go take a look at the album now go to albums and 2015 Cuba trip and there's just a bunch of pictures right at this point I want a map and some text telling the story of our trip to do that you tap the three dots edit album and map and done. You can drag it into place, touch and hold until it kind of gets attached to your finger and move down to where you want it to be and let go. Now I also want to add some text and check mark and check mark on the whole album. Now you will need Wi-Fi in order to do this while you're on the trip and there wasn't much in Cuba but pretty much every day we had some place where there was Wi-Fi which would mean our photos were automatically uploaded and we could play with making our albums at any time while you're on the bus or waiting for dinner no problem. And if you chose to share your album while still on your trip, your family and friends see your photos as you add them.
and by the time you're home, it's all done.